is up everyone welcome back to the channel i'm back here with a little special pickups it's um no games or is it you will be able to, or is it you might have noticed in the title it's basically a comic edition of pickups because it's got there's a point where i'm picking up comic books putting them on my instagram or whatever sh showing certain people I'm not sharing, sharing with you guys. Um, but as you like it, it will say the title, it will say like comic edition, pick up sort of thing. So, obviously, if you are not into comic books, fair enough, you don't have to watch the video. But if you are, um, fantastic. So, these are not all uh, books picked recently, but these are ones I think will sort of be more interesting. But some bottles, you when I do these comic ones more regularly, it'll be between now and then that new books are picked up, um, books add to rounds and things like that. But I think some of these books are the start of runs. Uh, start of runs, the end of a run, first issues. Book that look, a book that looks interesting, you'll see why. Also, if you look at my Instagram today, as we were recording, which is Friday, you you would have saw that. Um, so yeah, I'm also got a little cheeky whiskey. So, um, I got the, 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 the first four books out of the way because these are the first four issues of a run. Um, not read these ones yet, um, but um, me being a Star Trek fan, I had to pick this up because the first season of Star Trek was the Star Trek books, but obviously, the sort of thing that touches upon is the to the title, but it's the Mirror Wars, the Mirror War, um, which from what I'm guessing is due, due to the Mirror Universe in Star Trek, which, if you know, if you know Star Trek, you know, but it's, I've got a shoe from, um, it's got a data cover, which I really like the look of, um, issue two, so you know, I think that is quickly Cisco from Deep Space Nine and I forget her name but basically she was in Next Generation. I don't remember, I don't remember her name but I remember I really enjoyed her character in Next Generation. Um issue three with um basically a mirror universe of we're going to write out and issue four. So, obviously, I, with not in most books, I think start the usual ones to are, are doing them. Um, there's like multiple, multiple covers, sort of thing. Um, I think with one or two of them that, that when I picked them up from. When I went to a road trip with Retro Ed, uh, one of the stops we went to was a comic shop, a comic book shop, which I wanted to do. One, one of the books was in there, the multiple covers, I just chose my favourite. Um, I'm not necessarily a variant sort of, I'm one of these people that do variants, like in, in the sense that I pick up multiple versions of the same book to have all the variants. With me, if I go to a store and it is, um, like the next book I want to show you, was in my subscription, or if you in my subscription, or you know, new one sort of picking up books you're in there for, and they have multiple versions, I'll pick my favourite. Like I said, with this next book, um, it was the last issue of Deathstroke Inc., which I read. Um, if you've not read it, and if you are a Deathstroke fan, please, I highly recommend read them. Um, but this was based in my subscription box, and 
the um the animation went on at this very issue which one do you want sort of thing so I picked it up which is this one uh, it, do not do it wrong I prefer the artwork for the other one but I prefer this one um which is it, it was really annoying because um there's a channel I watch call what comment on or whatever it is they talk about sort of sales like going up on certain books each week sort of thing and one of them was I think issue five of that Deathstroke book um it was like a rather variance I think like one in twenty five selling for like forty fifty bucks I'm like if only I had that variant um but I'm talking about books that are selling like sort of selling sold well um was in all the books I had in my subscription box, uh, which I'm saying weren't many, was, was Death Row King, the Harley Quinn animated series, and Batman vs. Bigsby have now all ended. So I'll send to a mate of mine, I'll, I'll, I need to find books to sort of pick up to read, something like that. He said, with two books, this we came out this week, read them both, enjoyed both. Both are in my subscription box as of today, of the Jordan. Um, but when I went into the, the shop and sort of said, like, can I add this um, to my, my subscription? Um, I, she said, like, do you have issue one? I went, yeah, because the, like, the owner, John, said, like, read both books. Basically, if you like them, then I'll put them in, in your, your poor list. I went, yeah. I mean, you're lucky because it's that's one of the few books this week that sold out. Um, and it's it's strange. Normally, books I read, obviously, they sell well, but obviously, this is one of the few books that issue one sold out, whether it's because of the front cover, but it also shows you it's Shadow Wars Alpha. Um, says that it sold out but it's whether it's due to the cover I don't know whether it's because of the people looked at the previews I don't know is it I don't know why it sold out I I don't know what I to me I read it I read it day, day off I enjoy the story so for me it's as a fan, I'm sure I'm sure see why it's sold out. But as generally speaking, I don't. Um, but she said like she said like if, if all the other issues don't like the first one, yeah, but you pretty much have to put it in sub box. But if not, if you unless you unless you come in day pretty much day of early, it, it, bear in mind, books come up Wednesday. I went in to Dali. So that's basically pretty much 48 hours and it's yeah, sold out. So, which never been a bit picked up that day. It was a recommendation of a, of a mate. Um, not a recommendation. In a sense of recommendation, you know, like, like Batman, but it's more of a case of, um, you know, like Batman, he, he's trying to sort of. He, I like the. Front cover on type books a lot of front cover video day has to draw you in. Which like the other one, this one did, and that is Batman Beyond the White Knight. Um after I say the show well was it's compared to most books, a little bit more expensive, but it's slightly for the book, for the same. But this one it's a regular regular easy for me to say price book. But this one was very wordy. Um, this one is. I was trying. To, I was I was trying to keep up certain pages of multiple times, but it was eventually clicking. So much so I enjoyed it, and then White Shadow Alpha. It's in my poor book. Um, what I'm, I might do. Read the other books I had subscribed, or the 
in my in my pool list. I want to try and get a third book because I want at least try have three books rotating. But pretty much like when I had Batman vs Bigby, Deathstroke, and Harley Quinn, it was pretty much every every week or every other week one of my books was coming out. And uh, but yeah. But sometimes it's good to have. I've done a with every other, every shop, but where I'm in both of them, the car in the shop, basically say, like, if you, um, like when I picked up, when I came up, like the 350 pet, three, the books that were 350, it was like, you know, if it's in your pool box, it's three quid. Um, so you need a little bit of a discount. Um, with the, Shadow War Alpha, I don't know because if it's doing the same price all the time, I don't know. But yeah, moving on. Um, pick, I picked this book I picked up when I went with Rich Red to Ipswich, Ipswich, No Base, and Red right now. But I picked the one in Ipswich. This one, Peter, people that know me, you know why. Um, and that is. Master Universe Revolution is one. People know me know I love Kevin Smith. Um massive Kevin Smith fan. I think I'm one of the last compared to a lot of people compared to most people, I'm very, very, very beyond the TV show. I think I'm one of the last episodes of First Part. Um I picked this up but I made it my did make make Jamie aka J Paul. Um I would I'm going to put a link, a, um, link to yourself down below. He ordered me, uh, I'm, I'm assuming that like these sort of, um, basically all the issues in one book of this, um, which at some point, if someone meet up, I will be picking up. So yeah, there's that. Um, again, what I'm not trying to do is find out if that is all the issues. Um, and if it is, I'll read that and sort of work it out from now. And the last issue, last issue, last book I picked up, I picked up actually today. Um, picked up two weeks, a couple of reasons. A, the front cover looks interesting. And because I'm a bit of a perv, it sort of went well. Um, and that is, was if you do, if you read comics, I know some people in our community, I know Richard Chef reads books, comic books, so he might know more about this book than I do. But if, if you read comic books, you know a lot more about this book, or anything about this book, help me out, please comment down below. And it's called Hack and Slash versus Chaos. Obviously, being a bit of a uh, sort of cut, the it sort of went well. Plus, it's. Yeah. The corner book is mature. Clearly, the front cover is mature. Um, uh, I know some books when they say mature, it, it, it is more of a sort of. Could go either way of like sexualized or graphic, um, or both. Um, so the comic books I picked up recently. Um, what I might do is, as you might have noticed, with video game pickups have been a bit slow, or extra like sloth slow, which I do apologize for. Um, so. What I might do every now and then mix up between video games and comic books just to put something out there. I know not everyone's into comic books, which I'm going, I'm going to basically apologize now for. Um, but thank you guys for watching. Um, again, if you've read any of these books, um, especially the, book, like the books I said I haven't or have, don't know a lot about like the last book I showed um page comment down below if you're not any information um if you have read Star Trek World War please comment 
please let me know if this book worth jumping onto as soon as possible to read. Um, and if you do read and if you do any suggestions of books for me to sort of jump onto, um, please let me know. And thank you guys for watching. Ciao for now.